Well, in sad news, Justin, Zanella Kremagwazam Sibi, the president of the National Freedom Party, has died. She was 59 years old. The cause of her death is unknown at this stage. Kamagwazam Sibi was a former school principal. She served as branch chairperson of the Inkata Freedom Party in 1976. Later, she served in several senior administrative positions in municipal councils. Kamagwazam Sibi was also the deputy minister of science and technology between 2014 and 2019. We'll bring you the updates on her story as it happens. Well, for reaction now, we speak to her party member of parliament, Ahmed Sheikh Imam, is live on the line now from Durban. Uh, Sheikh, uh, first of all, our sincere condolences. Um, this must come as a terrible shock. Yes, thank you very much for that. Great, indeed, a great shock. And with sadness, you know, we note the untimely passing of our leader, President Zanele Kamagwazan, CB. Uh, do we uh, do we know uh, anything around the circumstances around her passing? Uh, was she ill for a long time? I'm just thinking this must be a terrible shock, not just for you, but for her family too. Well, I personally always enjoyed a very close relationship. We enjoyed a mother and son relationship in this party, you know. Uh, I've always been motivated by the way she's conducted herself and how she selflessly uh, served the interest of the most vulnerable and the poorest of the poor in the country, particularly in the areas where she had the opportunity to govern as the mayor, like in Zululand and things. She, you know, in 2014, November, she had a massive stroke and she had not really uh, recovered from that. However, despite her challenges, she continued to serve our people. She's been seen. Uh, made herself visible in many of the gatherings and things when he were required. Uh, and she was then admitted into hospital in Mshlanga uh, a couple of weeks ago. She hasn't been well, particularly I'm advised that it was COVID-related and she's been in the ICU. And unfortunately, this morning, uh, uh, you know, she passed on. Just tell me a little bit, please, if you could, and for our viewers, uh, of uh, Mrs. Kwamagazam Sibi's legacy that she leaves behind. Well, you know, we, we know that she started at a very early age, at the age of about 12, and she used to belong to the Encarta Freedom Party. She went on to become a member of the provincial legislature. She held many senior positions in the IFP. She's been in the mayor of Zululand for many, many years, and I think that's where she's earned her name because she was very dedicated and committed to serving our people. And then, of course, in 2014, the National Freedom Party was launched in 2011, but in 2014, we ended up with six members of the KZN legislature and six in the national court, uh, uh, parliament. Of course, then she took ill in November, and that has had a devastating effect in the party itself. And it affected her mobility. It affected her attending gatherings and meetings. Uh, but despite that, you know, she attempted to do her best. Uh, so, yes, indeed, I think if she does leave anything behind, is is their selfless a commitment and passion to want to serve and make a difference in the lives of the people. She, it was the same leader, Zanela Kamogwazam Sibi, who said that she will not allow her people to have homes built with the toilets 50 meters away from the house. She always said she wanted those toilets inside the house so people could have water and sanitation inside the house so they could live with dignity. Well, thank you so much for coming on air at short notice to pay tribute to your colleague. Uh, once again, our condolences and uh, please pass them on to our, her family too.